have uh, bower compressors in the back of the aquarium, uh, which provide me with breathing air and the water. And if in the uh, unlikely uh, circumstance that one of the compressors fails, we have a second and a third supply of breathing air and the water. And then I have gas devices which uh, monitor the air that is inside so that I can keep a track on the oxygen and carbon dioxide levels. Okay, also es ist für alles gesorgt. Die Luftzufuhr, auch wenn sie mal ausfällt, gibt es noch ein zweites und drittes System. Ähm, ihm wird es gut gehen da unten. Außerdem ist er natürlich top fit. You were in Rome last weekend. What did you do there? Ah, uh, yeah, last week in Rome I went to run a marathon. Uh, I wanted to make sure my legs were as tired as possible, so I didn't feel anxious to start running when I was in my box. So now I can just rest in my sleeping bag on my bed and take it easy. Apart from the world record, of course. <laughs> Scientific investigations, which ones? Yes, well, we have the Divers Alert Network of Europe who are participating in a research study here. Um, we also got their advice for the uh, safety procedures because this is quite new, obviously, to Legoland to have an underwater house. So we decided to consult with um, someone who specializes in this kind of thing. And they will also be taking some measurements prior and after the, the study for their own scientific research to try and make uh, diving a bit safer. And I'm also working with a friend of mine, Dennis Chamberlain. He's an aquanaut from uh, NASA. He's a bioengineer and he's also interested in what I find during my two weeks because he's also building his own undersea habitats in the United States. <laughs> Okay, also Menschen auf der ganzen Welt sind beteiligt. Dennis Chamberland ist Bioingenieur bei der NASA und der wird die Langzeitauswirkungen auf den Menschen unter Wasser genau beobachten und testen, natürlich bei Lloyd. Und es gibt noch das Divers Alert Network, das ist eine Taubart-Organisation, eine internationale, und die achten auf die Fließeigenschaften des Blutes von Lloyd, wie sich das verändert und auf lange Sicht kann so eben das Sporttauchen sicherer werden. Es wird nicht sehr langweilig werden da unten, also du hast irgendwie von Urlaub gesprochen, aber du hast auch viele Aufgaben, viele, viele Fragen werden dir gestellt. How do you communicate with the outside world? Uh, yes, I have internet underwater, uh, so I can connect to the underwater record website. Uh, I also have Twitter and Facebook, so people can keep track of me on those uh, social network sites. Uh, yes, I have an underwater laptop, so that I can keep my blog updated and an intercom for the visitors to the aquarium itself so twice a day children can ask me questions and I can answer them from my house. I think as many as I'll end Yes, I think so. I mean, everything is inside. It's just a matter of getting in there and getting comfortable. It still takes some hours, of course, and uh, if I need anything, I have a support crew here. They're only five minutes away, so it should be good. The Luft is warm, wind is warm, and we'll see how it is. Lloyd, can you hear me? Hello, Lloyd. Bis jetzt hört er noch nichts, ne? Aber er hat immerhin schon das T-Shirt für die erste Woche an. Wunderbar. Lloyd, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hervorragend, das klappt doch schon mal. Und jetzt starten wir 14 Tage. Welcome home, Lloyd. 14 days now. <lacht> Thanks for reminding me. <lacht> So, the shark said hello to you? Uh, he wasn't at the door this time. I don't know what happened, but anyways, <laughs> I'm sure he's not too far away. Okay, also der, der Haie wartet sonst immer ganz gerne an der Tür unten, aber der wird sich nachts auf jeden Fall davor legen. Manche haben einen Wach und Leute hatten einen Wach Hai. Where's your toilet? Where, where do you go there? Ah, uh, yes, the toilet. <laughs> 
Lord Gotzen lebt hier im Legoland Deutschland 14 Tage ganz alleine auf nur 4 Quadratmetern. Das sind 336 Stunden, die er Zeit hat, um 2500 Wattstunden Strom zu erzeugen und damit einen neuen Guinness Weltrekord aufzustellen. When you entered the house and I said in the in the movie I had really tears in my eyes because I thought it's real what we did so many months and he won't come out for 40 days because it, it was just rehearsals and tests I never believed that you will stay inside. 